What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Billy Kibaki and in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to convert PSN PKG games over into folder games. So that's PSN PKG games over into folder games so that you can play them on your jailbroken PS3 or your PS3 hen using a portable hard drive or copying it over to your PS3 or you can simply load it using webman games all right so what you need to do first is make sure that you guys go ahead and watch this video because it's very useful it will show you how to locate your at that file on any ps3 whether it's cfw or ps3 hen make sure that you guys watch this video first the link will be in the description because you will need your act that file all right all right so let's go ahead and get started now okay so right here we have uh, um, a folder with our game the wrap file idps and uh, the act that right here we have the psn liberator version 1.0 when you have this on your computer, make sure that you turn off your antivirus because you will get a virus pop up and your antivirus will delete the program. So make sure that you turn off your antivirus when you have this on your computer. Okay. And right here, I also have um, all the wraps, like 14,000 wraps, right? So let's go ahead and get started. First thing you want to do is go ahead and extract the PSN Liberator here. You're going to end up with this folder right here. What you need to do next is go ahead and go to your, your at that folder, copy the at that, go back out, go inside the PSN Liberator folder, and then you want to go inside the one that says tools right here you want to go to X data and you want to paste your at that right there the next thing you want to do is go back out and you want to you can do two things from right here you can use one wrap files like this you can use one wrap or you can use all the wraps it's highly recommended guys I would highly recommend this make sure that you extract all the wrap files and put it in the folder so just pay attention so go to the wraps folder go to the wraps folder right click and do extract here all right so now that we have the wrap folder right here go inside it and copy all the wraps okay so highlight it and then copy now go back go to the PSN liberator folder Go inside the one that says PSN content right here where it says riffs wraps go inside that folder and you want to paste all the files here all the wrap files there okay so once this is done copying over you want to go back out go out again and from right here we want to go ahead and run the PSN liberator exe so open it all right, so you will be prompt with this message right here. And as you all can read, it says number one, you will be prompt to copy over that file from your PS3. You will be prompt to enter your PS3 IDPS from Multiman, all right? So let's go ahead and press okay. Right here, it says copy your that file to the xdata folder. So we already did this part, right? So we did it right here. So we go to tools, X data. So there it is. So that's what it's saying right here. Okay. So we already did that right there. Press OK. Now it asks for IDPS. Now go back out, go out again. And right here, I have my IDPS. I will leave this in the description. You guys can go ahead and use it. If you're going to make a video using my IDPS, make sure that you use my original link or your video might get taken down. All right. So this is my I, um, IDPS. Go ahead and copy it. And it's going to 
you're gonna paste it right here it doesn't matter just go ahead and paste it right here it doesn't matter what type of ps3 you have go ahead and paste my IDPS right in this box here doesn't matter if your ps3 is banned or whatever just use the same I am um, IDPS okay press ok you're gonna get this message press ok now we can close this folder down now we have this um, box right here up top it says um, PSN game package file so that's PKG right here you wanna click here now you wanna search for your games so here and here I have the PKG game that I'm gonna use click open now down here is where the the wrap folder is so make sure that this folder is selected with the wraps you can double check it there it is the wraps folder right there and right here is the output folder so the output folder will be this folder right here all right now down at the bottom where it says liberate game as you want to make sure that you click on the one that says disk folder okay make sure that you click disk folder all right so click it and you're gonna get this um, page right here so just sit back and wait all right so now you will get this pop-up box right here telling you that everything went success um, successfully right here and here you can see that it found the wrap from the wrap folder so this is pretty good everything went okay now we can close this down we can close down the program now go to the folder where it says PSN content go to the one that says liberated here you will find that you now have a folder with the game name plus the title ID and it says liberated disk folder if you go inside it it will look exactly like a disk game now I don't know if these will work with mod menu but you can definitely try with GTA 5 and see if it works or not alright so what we're gonna do next is just copy go to our USB stick now don't pay attention to these these are files for something else okay these are folders for something else so on your USB stick make sure that it's FAT32 you want to go and right click go to new folder and you want to create a folder called games that's it go inside it and paste your liberated game right there all right so now that we have copied this over to our USB stick or you can have a portable hard drive it doesn't matter let's eject it and let's head over to the PS3 okay everyone so now we're on the PS3 just log into any user that you're using go ahead and launch your hen enabler if you're using hen if you're using a CFW PS3 just go ahead and launch multiman okay so hen has been enabled so I'm gonna go down to multiman and enter it alright so here's the game guys so this is the game that we just liberated as you all can see right here it shows USB um, drive right there so we're just gonna go ahead and press X and load the game or you can press triangle and you can copy the game over to the PS3 hard drive it's definitely up to you but I'm just gonna go ahead and press X and load the game from my USB device all right let's go up and here is the game right here so yeah now we can go ahead and uh, start the game and there it is guys so that's how easy it is to convert PKG games over to folder games very simple very easy like I said if you're gonna use my IDPS in a YouTube video make sure that you leave my original link in the description because it is my own IPS from my PS3. Afterburner Climax. 
Alright, so if the video was helpful, please leave a like, share the video around, and also you guys can subscribe for more videos to come. Thank you all for watching. See you guys next time.